so you're from St. Louis, right? Yeah, STL, let's go. Okay, and so is that where you first, um, well, the, the Rams weren't there, obviously, when you were growing up. No, when so. I was growing up, there was the Cardinals, Cardinals right? right. Uh-huh. And, but nobody, you know, they, they were owned by the Bidwills, and everybody hated him, and so, <laughs> and then when they moved, it was like, all right, good riddance. So, but then the Rams came, and they came basically in the heyday of my rise, as a comedian, so mm-hmm. the the greatest show on turf and all that stuff, I was extremely popular, and so were the Rams. And so, you know, I was I was living out here more, but you know, of course, I, I'm from St. Louis, so I had to rep them. You know, that was the, that was the team, but they were fun to watch, and the city was bubbling, and it was just it was a St. Louis thing at the time. Nelly, you know, me, yeah. Nelly, the Rams, all of it's going down. St. Louis was getting the shine, so you know that was. That was one of those ones where you had to like, kind of like, love what, what was happening for your city. One of my favorite people on the planet is Marshall Falk. I'm yeah, sure you've Falk met him dope. multiple yeah. times, and I'm oh, sure, yeah. sure he loves you too. Yeah, Falk is my man, man. But, you know, and all those guys, Tory Holt, they were great. Isaac Bruce, that was just a fun time. You know who I don't think I've ever met was Kurt Warner. Is that right? I don't think I. I could fix that. Well, yeah, man. Come I could fix. I'm seeing him tomorrow. I kept going to the grocery store he used to work at. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so shopping for cereal, <laughs> looking for the quarterbacks. Is Kurt here? No, yeah. Oh no, he's moved on. Said he. he has. He's he has, a big star now. Yeah, he he's no longer. He he's no longer stuffing the yeah, uh, canned yeah. soup. Yeah, it's right. He's not boxing Prudos. Yeah. Prudos no more. Yeah. yeah, he's been away a long time, right? He does not box in Prudos. A, 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 a little stack of kale costs. So isn't it funny now the Rams are here, right? Yeah. So that you know that was actually great too because. You know, it, it was, you know, uh, my friend uh, Otto uh, Malley is, you know, connected to the team. Mm-hmm. And I've been knowing him from the Missouri days. And so, you know, when they came, it just was like really kind of, you know, uh, cool. I felt like St. Louis was upset that the Rams were leaving. Yes. And I kind of felt like my team was coming to me. So, uh, again, I keep winning. It's like like my dressing room all over again. Nice, right? <laughs> yes. Even so, even if you lose a yeah, team, even you win. I lose, yeah. I'm like, guys, look what I did. I brought the team here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And I know you go to games. I've seen yeah. you. I've seen you there. You yeah. Know. And it was, I mean, they were, one, the stadium was, was, is a really beautiful place, unique stadium, fun to go to. And then the, you know, that I mean, they went to the Super Bowl the first year. And then won the second year, so yeah, they they I mean, when they like, they came here and Sean McVay took them yeah, and they man. lost to New England and then you know yeah and then winning in, in SoFi yeah, the Stadium the first time the stadium was open that season that's amazing so I mean it was all electric I was all on the field I mean, you thought I'd have been in right? practices oh man is that right I got pictures of me I'm out there with with Aaron Donald like yes look at us <laughs> you know, I'm like bro I was I didn't come to one practice he's a human muscle that oh man. my god he's such a huge dude and just, but a nice guy but mm-hmm. so solid just Rock solid human being. Okay, so which yeah. is your basketball team out here? Which yeah, my team. team. I'm 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 Lakers out here. Okay, uh, but I grew up in St. Louis. We didn't really have a basketball team ever. So mm-hmm. of course the the Bulls, and especially the Jordans Bulls, they were the team that we can hop on a Southwest flight and go to and go and hang out in Chicago. Yeah. So that was my team too, and I so I still love the Bulls for that reason. You ever meet Jordan? Yeah, yeah, man. I met MJ many times. You know. Uh, his golf tournaments, performed for his birthday. You know, it's what always around Super Bowl t- times. So. What do you mean you perform for his birthday? So he would have these birthday parties where, you know, you go up and you have a good time. I remember <laughs> it was a classic Jordan thing, man. I walked out with some uh, Adidas shell toes on, man. Uh-oh. Some, I mean, Uh-oh. and he lit it to me. I'm, tr- I'm there to tell the jokes. And he's like, what you doing, man? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, huh? I didn't even know what was going on. I was like, you didn't, I didn't think about realize, it? I didn't even realize oh. it because, you know, I was wearing a suit and I was like, you got basketball shoes. They don't go well with suits, Mm-mm. but the chill toes, they kill the suit, man. I'm, I'm more about, about style, bro. So I got let me get this up, straight. Bro. So he hires you yeah. to perform for his birthday and yeah. make everyone laugh. Yeah. You come out in the wrong shoes Whoa. and he starts heckling you. Oh, man, killing me. I, I, and I didn't even know why he was upset. I, it did not. It, it did not happen. I I couldn't figure it out. 
until he was like, what's with them shoes? And I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> I was like, oh, well, I wear a size 13. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> we so can fix that easily, guys. Just send, send a bunch of shoes. Well, I'll figure it That's out. That's right. Yeah. Then, yeah. then you won't have this yeah, problem again. It's his fault. Be. It is his fault. You need to be better. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern, for free.